Hey everybody, this is Tambio and I'm back with another Transformers video review. This time I have Combiner Wars Legend Size Skywarp. So this is a uh, repaint of the Starscream and Thundercracker that they've released. Well, uh, Starscream wasn't in Combiner Wars, but Thundercracker was in Combiner Wars line. Uh, so you have that and uh, so you can see a picture of him up here. He doesn't combine with anybody or anything. He's just an extra figure. You come back here, he transforms in eight steps. Here is his bio, and let me bring that close to you, so it's not really that long, so you probably don't need to pause it to read it. Um, probably read it while I was jabbering on. Uh, there is some warnings right here, and it's probably the same that's right here. I haven't really read it. It says meet in Vietnam, which is um, that's cool. Um, so let's go ahead and get it out of the package and check them out. Alright, so here we have Skywarp out of the packaging and in his aircraft mode. I'm going to save for these little guys they're not too bad they're pretty good uh, they look a little weird on the underside but that's about it uh, he does come with a uh, <clears throat> once again the little trading card type things and that is an image from I think it's Transformer Legends that's from the card game alright well uh, once again I do have a video of Thundercracker so uh, if you wanted to check out the transformation it's gonna be up here in the tab other than that I'm gonna transform them and it'll be real quick so, uh, you know, if you blink, you might miss it. Okay. Uh, another thing about this figure, I don't know if I explained this with Thundercracker, that most of the purple on this thing, uh, with the fins, the foot and the nose cone right here they're all uh, like a rubbery plastic here so they're real soft um, now the hands are they're actually painted on so or the, the purple on the hands are actually painted on the arms and hands um, so let's raise this up a little bit uh, on the camera it's coming through a little bit more of a bluish purple, but it's uh, actually very purplish, purple, very purple. <clears throat> so for uh, articulation, we'll go ahead and get into that. He just the head, nothing on the head. <laughs> then you come here to the arms. The shoulders has a ball joint, so forward, back, out to the side. Then you have the elbow it is a, another ball joint, so you can get twist it left and right, you can bend it a little above 90 degree. Um, then here at the hips, because there is no waist, so hips forward, back, out to the side, because it was on a ball joint, and then there is no cut here, so you can't twist, you can only twist it based on the on the ball joint. Uh, then you have your knee, and it goes, what's that, that's about 90 degrees, and then you have this front toe and the back toe, uh, you can move those around uh, mainly because of transformation, but uh, you do have a little bit of wiggle room on those because of that. Other than that, like I said, it's not a bad little figure um, for, you know, if, if you like collecting seekers and stuff, then uh, this is definitely something for you. So with that, I'll go ahead and conclude this review. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter. This has been Tambieta, and I'll see you next time.